Okay, it's time for another new product taste. And this time it's, whether I can pronounce this properly, so um, pardon me if I don't pronounce it properly. I think this is pronounced Thai Sea Chilled Tea. And it says relax, and it's a blueberry and lavender. Um, it's plus vitamin C. And um, it's non carbonated, so if you don't like um, things fizzy, this will be right up your street. Now, the, the thing that caught my eye with this particular drink is the lavender, because I mean, I, I, I'm, I've never heard of a, um, a, um, a drink or even a tea containing lavender before. Blueberry, I have, whether it's in bubble tea, carbonated drinks, normal drinks, fruit juices, etc., 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 but lavender. Is um that's the kind of first time I've I've ever um seen it being used in a drink. Normally you would associate lavender in like um essential oils, um and lavender is normally has a very distinct smell to it, and normally lavender is used as a calming um kind of an element. So um if you for example have you're stressed out or have trouble sleeping, lavender. Is is usually a good car is a normal normally a good calming relaxant. So I suppose in this um chilled tea that um that's what um obviously it's, it's supposed to do. And then obviously you got with the added blueberry um um fragrance to the actual drink itself, obviously that should work in contrast with the lavender. Um, you, you, I'm starting to see that now lavender is starting to use be used in um in more um products now it's kind of very versatile so it's not just in essential oils now that um, it's been commonly used in um a lot of the time obviously with the essential oils you can use it um obviously on pressure points um pressure pulse points throughout the body that's supposed to be um, um relaxing obviously you can also use um, essential oils and um, the lavender ones or any essential oils really in um diffusers as well so that's meant to be very good so wherever you are you, you put your diffuser you can smell smell right for lavender but now they're using now you can get lavender um bath soaps now you can get lavender shower gels lavender body mist and even pillow mist as well and again it's meant to be calming and also um lavender balms which are supposed to be good again on um pulse points throughout the body um you can now um get um lavender lotions um lavender body scrubs so it's 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 a very versatile um um material that's being used a, a lot more often now. a similar thing with now with with turmeric where now um turmeric is meant to be good it's meant to be good for the body it's meant for the body it's meant to be um, turmeric is meant to be um, an element that is meant to be good at cleansing the body, especially with blood and stuff like that. And now, you're seeing the, the turmeric, for example, being used in everything. Like you can get turmeric teas, um, turmeric tablets, um, turmeric pretty, pretty much being put in everything these days, and it's a very um, good um, um, thing in in cleansing the body. So, like I said, as I said, I found this in my local Holland and Barracks. Usually, this goes for um two pounds but um i've seen it in some of the i've actually got two cans of this and um it was reduced to 99p so you can't argue so i, just, I made sure that i got this one pretty chilled so it's going to be interesting to, to see how this is going to taste and to be honest um i've had a pretty what, tiring day so it's going to be i'm going to be very interested to see on whether or not this will be um this actually will work in helping me sleep and being a, a little bit more calm Especially with my football club Tottenham, so I I definitely need need one of these. So without further ado, what should I open up? This is it says here, um, low calorie, no artificial ingredients, vegan and gluten free, crafted in the UK. Float away to a drifty, dreamy place with Tishi. Relax. If I'm pronouncing that properly. This little treasure is smooth. And a soothing blend of real Kenyan black tea, extenuated with notes of oolong, blueberry, and lavender. Relax 
is a low is lower in caffeine than or other blends and contains natural antioxidants. It's sophisticated in uh, indulg indulgent and floral blend for that time in for that time of day when you want to unwind. Perfect for me. We're about keeping it real, based in Oxfordshire. We're a small bunch of real people making real chill tea with purpose and they've actually got a website as well and so i might actually follow that so again as i said you don't have to worry about the sugar plus it's got vitamin c in it so as i say bottoms up having a little smell then um, so you can't convey that i can't convey that on camera but what i will say about the smell of it i def i'm smelling the blueberry more I do smell a slight hint of lavender with the smell, but I'm smelling more of the blueberry. It's the thing that's coming across the smell most, but with the taste, that probably going to be a little bit different. So, bottoms up. Yeah, I'm definitely t tasting the, the blueberry more. I can, I can, I do taste. A slight hint of the lavender. It's not overpowering because lavender's got a quite strong, pungent smell. And I'm definitely, it doesn't feel like it's overpowering. That's probably why they chose the blueberry to match the lavender um, fragrance. It's probably done on purpose. Have another sip. Yeah, definitely tasting the, the, the blackberry. The blueberry, sorry, more. And I'm definitely tasting the lavender aftertaste. Um, once that this once the blueberry um taste um, dissipates, and I'm definitely I can definitely taste in the, with the liquid the actual smoothness of the liquid. It's not um it's not too bitter, and it's not too sweet, and it's quite refreshing. I would say so. It's definitely really nice. I would say maybe just for some people it's a, a quiet taste. But yeah, it's actually um really nice. As again, with with me like with me being diabetic, sometimes you can have things where it's too sweet. And that's not good for for your sugar level and it can be a, some of the, some drinks can be too sweet and it can be too um I'm trying to think of the um the right word. Um it just Tastes too too sugary, so if it's so it's more, so you, it ends up being a bit too sickly. But this is kind of quite nice. I would say that if you're gonna drink this, definitely get it nice and chilled. If if you want to sit there and get the the benefits of this particular drink, but yeah, it's actually really nice. I mean, it's a shame that they don't do um do a bigger variety. I mean, they there are um other different um drinks that they have in in a range ranges of drinks and that they have available. And I'm curious to try uh, in wanting to try them out. I did see when I was in Holland Barracks, they did have I think it was a ginger and lemon. And I don't know if that was a set, they had it at half price as well. But if they if I do go back in a week and I do see that um they they had that that same that that particular one at price, I probably will go back and try it out. But yeah, it's definitely a winner. Hopefully, it will be it will have a calming effect and I'll be able to sit there and sleep better tonight. Anyway, I hope people found this video informative. Please feel free to share and to like with your friends and family. If you also, if you can give the video a thumbs up, that will also would help when people find my content and my channel on YouTube, because especially with the YouTube algorithms and it favoring more of the bigger um, YouTubers. And also, if you haven't subscribed to my channel, please feel free to sub to my channel. And I'll speak to you all again soon. So wherever you're in the world, Take care, stay safe, and I'll speak to you all again soon. Bye for now.